quick recap on uh, last week's game against Notre Dame. I thought we did a lot of nice things on both sides of the ball. Our tackles, our missed tackles were way down. We had seven of those, which was a, a big improvement from the previous week of 17. I thought the guys were playing hard. It's a very physical game on both sides of the ball. Um, if you look at the tape and the thing that you see is uh, we have to make a couple more plays. You don't have to make them all, but you have to make a couple more plays in the second half to potentially change the outcome of the game. It was a corner blitz we brought that we got to get that guy tackled. Uh, we also had a couple plays offensively. We dropped a slant and uh, D'Angelo on a crossing route that uh, if you hit that, it's a uh, uh, you got a chance to be right in the, the thick of the thing in the fourth quarter. So uh, proud of how they played. The, the, the big thing is you got to improve. That's the biggest thing as a football team is you got to improve from week to week to week. And each week presents a different challenge. So uh, you know, Southern Illinois comes in here. They're, they've done a nice job. They're 3-0. And uh, we're looking forward to uh, playing those guys on Saturday. Well, I think that's that's uh, that's got to be the key for our football team. That's one of the things I mentioned to them right after the game is that you put it out there, the energy level, the effort, the uh, the um, intensity, the volume that you played with, all those things. You got to you got to play that way each and every week. It doesn't matter who you're playing, and that's showing respect for the game. Whether you're playing Notre Notre Dame or Southern Illinois, it doesn't matter. You have to play with a high intensity level. And then when you, when you look at Southern Illinois, they, they've got a running back who's transferred from Oregon State, a quarterback transferred from Eastern Michigan. What, what, what kind of problems do they present? Well, the running backs, I thought, think is very good. I mean, he's quick, he's explosive, he's very patient in the hole, he's got good balance. So we're going to have to do a good job of tackling him. And, uh, you know, when he gets the ball going north and south, he's, he's a better football player than when he goes east and west. So we've got to do a good job of making sure the ball flattens out. Uh, the quarterback has really done a nice job of finding opening guys. He's throwing a nice ball right now. We have to be able to get some pressure on him pretty early in the contest.